trying to slick down type for hair is gonna pop back up like that person in the room that that argument is over what happened oh, okay okay nah nah now nah, I just think it's funny I just feel like that's my hair as a person the shrinkage hey loves welcome to my youtube channel my name is christina moore if you're new here welcome so i am just going to wash and saturate my hair to prepare my hair for this attempt of a wet look it's going around on youtube so i decided to hop on it what i'm gonna do is take my favorite gel the Cara care protein gel if you have not tried this gel it's a little pricey but i always talk about it it doesn't leave my hair crunchy it leaves it soft so i'm just gonna apply that from the root to the end or end to the root whatever it's just getting on the hair okay i'm focusing on the root because i'm trying to get it as flat as possible and raking it through all i'm doing is just wetting the hair detangling it and applying the product and i'm also going to clip it back to make sure it doesn't puff up while i'm doing the rest of my hair and yeah that's about it So I'm on the last section of my hair. I'm just gonna use that brush that you saw me waving around earlier. I love using a bristle brush to kind of lay my hair down. I'm gonna bobby pin that in place. I decided to do a side part. I started doing my edges, but I forgot about my got to be glue gel. I start doing this for my edges. It does flake up after a few days, but this joint does not move, okay? I'll take it. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do that and put a scarf on and set it in place. Let this really just set in at least the front part of my hair for about 20 minutes. I'm going to switch scarves because I'm going to take this off and take out the clips. I'm very curious as to how this is going to go. I just feel like 3A, 3B, 4A, whatever, anything that's not 4B and 4C or any head that has the same curl pattern throughout is a little bit more respectful. Type 4 hair, not so much. Trying to slick down type 4 hair is going to pop back up like that person in the room that the argument is over. What was said? That's type 4 hair. What happened? Oh, okay, okay, nah, nah. Now I just think it's funny, I just feel like that's my hair as a person. Then also what I'm gonna do is take ends of the front part of my hair and just pin those together. I'm gonna sit under the dryer with the scarf on for maybe like 30 minutes. Alright you guys, so I sat underneath the dryer, I already know what type of party this is about to be. Um, let me just take it off before I open my mouth. Yeah. This is what it looks like. We're just gonna add a little situation here, there, bomb. So boom, that was really New York, but whatever. This is just the best that you can do with my type of hair. She's cute. Okay, don't get me wrong. She's cute. I just don't want people to think and see other people's videos or see this trend going and think that our hair does that. Everybody has so many different type of textures and curl patterns, which makes us all different, which makes us all amazing. But um, the shrinkage, the shrinkage is what gets us, okay? It's disrespectful. I mean, come on. Look at look at this. It's not a fail, but I don't feel like it looks like what the wet look typically is supposed to be. And that's because my hair is not that. And honestly, I don't want it to be. I appreciate my hair texture. It just looks like a bomb, flat, wash and go. If we wanted to get up in here and kind of flatten it with some more gel and really, really go in, we can attempt to do that, but I'm not, okay? <laughs> so I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Let me know if you're going to be jumping on this trend. Let's chat in the comment section down below. I love you guys so much. Also, don't forget that it is free to subscribe, sis. I love you guys so much. I'll see you in my next video. Stay blessed. Bye.